welcome back my family my auntie mp my old and my very new subscribers thank you guys for tuning and for your support for your sharing of my video god bless you all so guys today's video i'm going to be showing you how to make homemade uh, stronghold gel that can be used in any kind of hairstyle you want to use for male and for female for children as well so guys to make this simple and professional and natural ingredients and very very simple that you can do and you are going to get an amazing result without any chemical ingredients to uh, make it to have that hold consistency or that hold you know a uh, strong stay that can this uh, gel can be used and it's going to last you at least up to three days on your hair if you don't wash it out and it's not going to cause inchy it's not going to cause irritation or anything so first of all i'm going to go ahead to measure my water as you can see my water was that much because the ingredients from this are uh, in this gel you are not going to go above the ingredients guys at times i will say uh, more or less not there's no big deal maybe in this very one there's a big deal <laughs> there's a big deal so right now after measuring my water i'm going to also measure my sugar sugar in this case is going to help us uh to make this uh gel to be stronghold and not only that to give you that styling you like maybe you want to make it ponytail you want to make a slay or you want to make a, a coin um twist that's the finger twist or the main you want you to, to style your hair to make any hairstyle so sugar is going to help combine this this is why i say you need everything is natural because normally they use some chemical ingredients to you know to make this base to make it to be hold to hold very well i mean to say but in this case i'm going to just show you another way you can do it with your with natural stuff which is your sugar sugar is going to help to make this gel to be to be strong hold to last three days and not only that it's going to help to also lock the moisture from the water which is hydrating in your hair without you know weighing it down and not you know also going that dry okay so most ingredients they use as chemical stuff can make your hair to go dry because they are this thing to make it hold so right now after stirring thoroughly you are going to stir to make the sugar to dissolve then you are going to warm it in a double heat boiler for just 30 seconds so meanwhile as my water and sugar is on the double heat boiler i'm going to measure my glycerin so glycerin uh is our aumentant so i'm going to measure that right now in the this same uh, bacon of glycerin if you have the powder color natural color anyway that you use for your cake or maybe all those uh, acrylic uh you know uh color make sure you add it with your glycerin okay just as i'm doing with the liquid one so after that i also measure a uh, b panthenol b panthenol is an amazing is pro vitamin uh b12 is an amazing ingredient when it comes to a contact with your hair it helps to give your hair moisture and not only that it also helps to prevent your hair from dryness breakage and uh you know anything that can lead to hair fall so it's going to help to uh, vitaminize your hair it's also going to help to promote uh you know hair uh, growth okay meanwhile if you are into hair growth journey you want to do anything gel you also want to do it you also want to use a gel that does not have anything chemical or anything that will lead to breakage or dryness or you know prompt to break it you know as freezing because most gel can cause your hair to go freezing meanwhile this very one is not going to do that so i went ahead to pour uh, my water into the bacon with the colored and other things to just liquid fire it to be able to you know get it from that bacon okay so after that now i'm going to um this is where our powder gel come this is a uh, carrot this is a uh, sorry guys this is a uh, carrageenan seaweed 
you can use any powder gel of your choice but you know what guys i have tried every other powder gel to make this kind of method of gel i never found a gel except when i use also carbomel but i prefer using um this carriages seawood to prepare this but it gives me that consistency of that stronghold gel that i you know i've ever done with different friend gel most mostly other gel they can give you a styling you know uh, they will be moisturizing they will give you that styling uh let me see if you want to make it a, a gel for to twist your hair to style your hair they can give it they, they don't last that much so i don't know if that makes sense they don't last that much like when i use this uh seaweed uh seaweed i mean seaweed guys i'm sorry if i'm pronouncing it wrong it's called Kyragena seaweed um a powder gel so you can also use uh if you have uh moist you can also use that or that sea moss you can also use that but as i said it is just personal choice okay like this very gel i'm making is for my husband he loved it so much it's even that's after some days you just go ahead to just wash his hair off to you know it's just like to uh restyle it again why because this gel is really really strong hold gel if you do yours you are going to know what i'm trying to explain here right now so i'm going to go ahead to break it down because this is why you need warm water that you need to warm it down so the water will just be little bit slightly warm to help to open the pores of this uh a powder gel to so that it will not form that thick lumps but if you go ahead and pour it into a cold water the way it was it's going to form lumps but undermining that i'm still going to work it out by using my hand uh, mixer this is just to get it that smooth to facilitate it and not only that this is the best we are going to you know get it smooth because uh it's um you know it's seaweed so it has this super uh moist it's not like a uh a standard gum or guard gum or any other powder gum this is very particular it's so so moist okay it can tend to just form lumps and you cannot be able to do anything anymore so for that reason i would advise you to warm the water first before adding your powder just the way i did so right now after going ahead to uh, mix it with my hand mixer i'm just going to stir it like this to remove bubble and air to remove all the stuff so that you are going to find it will come so crystal so beautiful with those just, just like those gel that you buy like uh you know eco styler and every other gel that you buy so by the time you allow it to cool now it's like this just the way it is that it seems uh you know uh like um now i'm going to put it something slimy but it's not going to be slimy so by the time it cools down completely just like uh now you are going to find it's going to uh come like that professional gel that cuts that does not you know fall from your hand so that's it so i just put it here now how to use this gel this gel can be used for finger a uh, twist can be used to make a ponytail can be used to slay your hair on your children's hairstyle on your edge can be used for edge control if you want to use to style your edge absolutely absolutely guys i'm not speaking tally <laughs> absolutely amazing for your you know our uh, edge control and not only that it can also be used for men if you have for your uh, men they want to style their hair and not only that it can also be used for if you have dreadlock so right now i've come to the end of explaining the use of this just so you can see at your left hand side the way it turned into as it has cooled down completely and this gel guys you are going to enjoy using this gel so what you need to do for me is to help me to share this video thank you guys for watching god bless you all as usual bye bye